Now, Hyde has said that if they were of equal weight, this wouldn't even be a fight. That's supposed to happen because at the weigh-in of 35 victories against only one loss with one no contest. Of 26 victories without a loss. Hands, good luck. Herbie Hyde might be compared to. Finally, the bell sounds. Richard Steele, the referee. Weight advantages would be by HBO. So for our purposes, this is not a world. Bo goes the first minute of the punch almost without throwing a fight. Before he finally. And even when he's going in punching, that heads up in the air. Doesn't move it with a good solid punch. I mean, he lets it low activity level so far. Gill is just not throwing anything. Well, I had mentioned. Hard some of the time against Donald and thought that he didn't have to. Another flurry for Hyde. Oh. Riddick Bo should have stayed in his dressing room for another three. Yo, but Bo didn't flinch. Step in, making me change. It's able to connect with power shots. And as you saw in the first round there, what those flurries seem. Now he's trying to impose his strength on Herbie Hyde. He talked about his ability to slip punches, and he does have the gift. Head button, he'd be disqualified. That Hyde did not throw, which means that Hyde has his respect. It's awfully early here. Round number two, and Bo connects. Little trickle of blood at the right nostril of Herbie Hyde. Bo momentarily stunned there. The chance to be done. Keep at him all the time. The bank at the bow was certainly was not deliberate. You see bow faint backs up and Riddick tries to follow it in. Stegging the top of Hyde is taking a little bit out of Hyde. He Long in danger of getting hurt if Bow can put something together. Down goes Hyde again. Try to finish. High takes advantage. Of Can he make it out of the round? Here we go. Away, son. Come on, boys. You gotta move. Don't stand. Don't. It's, I it's impossible see. to see what happened. And yet he got up by Hyde's punches. Amazing. By punch stat numbers, Bo landed only nine punches in the round. Spark. Well, that's what I think really happened. You can see he has plenty of cut at the moment. I think you're right. You know, sometimes a, his first big weird stuff happens when Riddick Bow fights. A series of events. The Bow Hyde. Left jab, and Hyde has already shown us two hard right hand shots. Hyde's out on his feet, and there we go. Riddick stalking an exhausted Herbie Hyde, and Hyde goes down. At a half a minute to survive or try. That's where Bow should have landed a left hook. That's going to get him out of the fourth round. Herbie Hyde showed us teeth height. A left jab, another one high in the head, right like a preppy. Uh, he has been down a couple of times on questionable knockouts, but, but he there was. Knockdown. The only shot that Hyde has. Hey, in danger here. He just Steel should be Bo. thinking about that. He just hit Bo with a right hook. No, Harley. Keep this is up, turning out for me. Either that or Bo is going into, again, remind me of two Golden Glovers in the finals. Just missed. Tired, Larry. It's very, very easy to feint and hit him with left. Didn't even hit him with that punch. He blocked off. Jim, I got to tell you, Nevada judges are notorious for calling rounds in rounds four and five. So I got a three rounds to two. The canvas for the number of times that Hyde has been on the canvas tonight. Hard right hand over the top. Dream technician, where did it all go, Gil? Come on, get up! No, no. Gambling. Steele kicks the white towel out of the ring. A good move by Steele. That may be it. Will this pick it up? A rusty. A distraught Herbie had to compete with him. Well, I, I felt that Bo was a great one. The Hyde kept the left knee on the canvas and. Simply to come in, or referee Richard Steele reaches the count of ten. Oh! 
41 more punches in the fight than did Bo. Not a lot of defense played here. I want to say happy birthday to my nephew, Eric. Hey, Eric, see you soon, man. 